Yo, what's up guys? This is Coach here, back with another video video today. And in today's video, I'll be showing you how to get invisible body parts on GTA 5 online after patch 1.41. And as you can see, this is a, in a regular session, as you can see right there. Alright, so I don't know if I'm the founder of this glitch or anything like that. And if you want a free shout out in my next video, put a shout out in the comment section and I'll shout you 100%. And if you want a free sub, put I subscribe in the comment section and I'll subscribe to you 100%. And, and the big special shout outs go to go check out the channel. The link will be in the description below. So let's get started with this glitch. Peace. All right, so what you do need for this glitch, you need a female character that has the blue Tron the blue deadline outfit all right that's all you need for this glitch and what you need need to do with this glitch is to do the direct mode glitch all right and i'll leave a link in the description below all right so i'll be back with y'all once i go to my female character my female character so let's just wait for it to load all right so once you go to your female character and for the deadline outfit, I believe it's like $200,000 or $100,000. All right. So go to outfits. And since I already have it, I'm just doing it right here. So once you do that, go to outfits and go to deadline. Then once you do that, as you can see, I have the deadline blue. All right. Then once you do that, you're just going to click on the outfit. Then after you do that, go to style and take off the helmet. All right. Then once you do that, just save just save the outfit. Oh yeah. Take off the helmet and the gloves. Alright. Helmet and the gloves. Let me just do that real quick. Alright, then once you have no gloves on, just save the outfit. As you can see, as you can see, I already have it saved. Right there, all right? Then once you do that, just do the direct demo glitch. Once you do that, all right? Then after you do the direct demo glitch, I'll be back with y'all once I get to my male character. All right, so once you are done with the direct demo glitch, you are gonna go back to your male character and you should have that outfit, all right? But you, you're not gonna be able to click on it, all right? Cause it's like glitched out. So as you can see, that was the outfit right there. But as you can see, it just shows the same outfit that I'm wearing right now. Alright? And that is good. Because if I try to go into the interaction menu, going to style, I'm going to access, and going to outfits. As you can see, when I go to the outfit, I can't click on it. Alright? It just goes to the next outfit. And that is a good sign that that you are doing it right. Alright? Don't you do that. Just put regular clothes on. Alright? Do not have any of your other outfits on or glitched outfits on. Alright? So... Go to standard and just put like the regular outfit on like that one right there all right then once you do that just take off all the accessories like the glasses and all that then once you do that go to a go to crooked cop all right you send verses and go to all the way down to crooked cop now you can go with a random person you could be host or you could join your friend all right doesn't really matter and i'll be back with y'all once i have people in there and when i'm in the session all right, so once you go to crooked cop the outfits have to be on player owned all right clothing has to be on player owned all right so let's just wait for it to load all right so once you do that go to the outfit that you have saved all right and it should pop up as a fully invisible outfit all right then as when you go to the owned outfit you should have that all right then once you get right straight into the actual mission you're just gonna back out with your phone all right okay now you're just gonna back out right away
and I'll be back with you once I'm in a session. All right, so once once you go to a, a regular session from quitting the Crooked Cop, you are gonna go to online, go to jobs, go to play job, go to Rockstar Created. Don't you do that? Go, go to missions and go to the first one that says a title of the job. Now, I rather you to be host because other people actually try to do the mission and you can't do like what you want to do in the mission, right? So I'll be back with y'all once I'm host. All right, so I am in a Titan of the job and I am host, all right? Then once you do that, you don't have to change any settings. Just confirm the settings and play. And once you do that, once you go straight into the mission, you, you should have the same invisible outfit that you had in Crooked Cop. All right. Now, if you do have it, that means you're doing the glitch right. All right. Then once you do that, you could go to the ammunition store, or you could go to your to your apartment. And as you can see, before you do this glitch, put up a, a point, a waypoint to your your apartment. All right. Now, if you want to put pants pants on it, merch shoes, and all that to any one that you want. You're gonna have to go to your apartment, all right? Then once you do that, you can pick any shirt you want. And as you see, your legs will still be invisible or the bottom of your body will be invisible. All right. So since I wanna put a shirt and pants on, I'm gonna go to my apartment, all right? So I'll be back with y'all once I'm at my apartment. All right, so I am in my apartment, in my wardrobe, and still in a Titan of the job. All right, so once you do that, and before you do this glitch, buy whatever clothes you want. All right, so you can already have it ready at your wardrobe since you can't go to the clothing store and all that, all right? Then what's super great about this glitch is that you can merge any kind of pants to any kind of shoes, all right? That's even the team pants and all that stuff. So, once you do that, you can pick whatever pants you want. I'm just picking the team pants because they go great with shoes and all that, all right? Then, once you do that, just hover over the pants, all right? Just hover over them and just back out. Now, if you push X, it will mess up everything, all right? And you, your feet should turn invisible. Then, go to shoes and you can pick whatever shoes that you want. As you can see. You can even get the black joggers with this and all that, all right? Now, if you want to restart, just go to any of your glitched outfits or other direct mode outfits. And if you want just invisible legs, just you can just pick any shirt, all right? So, I'll be back with you all once I create an outfit, all right? So, as you can see, I already created my outfit, all right? Now, as you can see, it has invisible legs and all that stuff. Now, if you don't want to, like, if you don't want shoes or anything like that, don't put shoes in the first place, all right? Now, you can just put a shirt or any, anything like that, all right? So, once you do that, if you want to save the outfit and go to an online session with this, I'm going to show you right now, all right? So, once you do that, go to online and go to creator. So, let's just wait for it to load. Then once you go to creator, you are going to want to go to create a race, all right? Then once you do that, go to land race. Has to be a land race, all right? Now for this, you can put anything that you want. Go to placement, place trigger. Place that anywhere you want. Checkpoints. Then once you do that, you can put them any, anywhere you want. So let me just do this real quick. Once you do that, once you're finished with all that, just test it. All right. So let me just do this real quick. All right, don't you complete it. Go all the way to online and go to play GTA online and go to go, all right? 
then I'll be back with you once I'm in a online session. Right. So once you go to the online session, you should you should have that invisible outfit that you created in a type of the job, all right? So let's just wait for wait for it to load. And as you can see, I do have the outfit. And just to make sure that you that other people other people can see you like this, just check it on there, all right? And as you can see, you have it in a online session on GTA 5 online after the patch 1.41. So make sure to hit the like button and to subscribe for more videos like this. And this is Goyge D, and I'm signing out. Peace. Yeah.